click on that right there. Hey guys, welcome back. On this quick little video from Pro Noob RC, tonight we're working on our STX24 Axial Jeep JL? You got JL? I think you're JL. Yeah, Jeep JL. Um, we're gonna call it the Pro Nubicon. It's no longer Rubicon, we've got a bunch of junk to it. So, anyway, fantastic truck. We're still running the stock tires on them, working great, but we finally were able to score a set of the new Hyrax 1.0 tires mounted on the um, Impulse black internal beadlock wheels from Proline. They're kind of a different design. They're kind of nice to see the different design going out there. They're kind of like a split and the kind of like the larger teardrop shape hole, kind of a little bit like a hybrid in there. So it looks pretty cool. We are going to throw some paint on these down the road, but so far what we've done is just drilled a three thirty seconds hole right there all the way through the inner ring and the, the rim itself to get them nice and vented. And they're super nice feeling. They do come with foams in them. Unlike the stock tires, it's just rubber, no foam. So we're gonna actually throw these onto the truck. We have a battery charged up, but we're gonna go throw it up on the uh, little rock mountain we have in the back and do some running. But first, we need to run it with the stock tires so you guys can actually see the performance increasing. The part number for those tires is 10194-10.
Okay, as you can see, we just ran the stock tires. Now these stock wheels actually have a little bit of weight. These are the, when these trucks first came out years ago, Jesse and I squished some uh, 22 caliber pellets and put them on the inside of these wheels. So they have a slight advantage, but as you guys can see, these tires get a ton of traction. These tires are well broken in already, but let's try those brand new Proline high racks. Those are good looking wheels, good looking wheel, good looking tire, suits a truck. I've never been the biggest fan of the Hyraxes because they always had like that little finger thing on there. Let's go see how they work. Okay, done. It's over. There he went. <laughs> so I don't remember the user name, the other ones were dusty. line on average with these trucks sometimes we're here for 20 minutes to get through here three minutes. somebody built a wheel dump right here and your back tire falls in there so no point having it easy if you want to train your head. It wasn't meant to be. Okay, well, I'm sure you guys can see the difference. Uh, the tires we were running stock were already, they were weighted. Where are they, where are they, where are they? Can you hear these? They got wraps of solder around the rims in them. These guys have wraps, wraps? Yeah, wraps of solder, wraps, I'm sure. They got wraps of solder in there and these weights. So we were already cheating, giving these tires a bit more of an advantage over these tires. Uh, just the rubber compound is amazing. Um, as you guys are gonna see in the video, this thing pretty much went anywhere we were pointing at it. 
Uh, the ESCs in these things are not the greatest, but they just came out with the V2 with new electronics, so we're hoping to get our hands on one of those soon and see if it's a little bit less chunky. It doesn't start at half throttle, you know what I mean? Uh, we do have the FuryTech powered uh, XJ Cherokee. We're gonna throw some of these pro lines on them. We just gotta fix our body mounts on the rear. They got smashed on our last run out. And the FuryTech gives them a ton of control over factories, so uh, we get some nice wheels on there, but we're going to actually change out these tires because they're pretty stiff too compared to these Pro Lines. And yeah, the RC four wheel drives are nice, but the Pro Lines are going to be a better tire. So that, that's their game, Pro Lines. They do tires and bodies, right? So um, yeah, blown away by those actually. Very impressed. Uh, they handled very well. So I recommend them, guys. Run out and get them. They are the Pro Line High Racks mounted on the Impulse B Log wheel. One. 10194-10. Okay guys, we'll see you on the next one. Jesse and I are gonna grab the micros. We're gonna do some micro rock crawling since it is minus 30 outside right now and nobody needs to live in that crap. So if you can, have some fun in your hobby room. We'll see you guys on the next one.